CRP Minute, continuing our coverage of UFC Wichita, UFC on ESPN Plus 4, and we are now three fights into the card, and we just saw a good flyweight performance being turned in by Matt Schnell, a young competitor who's been very vocal about saving this, about wanting this division saved, but being willing to go up to 35, he said earlier this week, if they didn't save this division, and watching Schnell tonight reinforce my belief that, that cutting this division would be a big mistake. There is definitely talent in this division. Matt Schnell is now a is 29 years old, 13 and 4 overall in his MMA career. He's now on a three-fight win streak inside the octagon coming off the Ultimate Fighter season 24 and he's 3 and 2 overall in his official UFC career. Luis Smoka is still only 27 years old and he was actually on a four-fight win streak coming into this fight. And some of that was outside of the UFC, where he had a four-fight losing streak back in 2017-16 time. Went out of the UFC for a while, came back and won a fight by a second-round armbar and just lost to Schnell. So he, uh, he had, he's had an up-and-down career, but he's been involved in the UFC off and on since 2014. He's got an overall UFC record now of 6-6. Six and six. And this division definitely does have talent. Schnell's been very, very vocal this week. And he backs it up this week weekend with a, with a good performance. And over a pretty solid veteran. So they had Matt Schnell coming into this fight ranked number 15 in the division. And one of the problems that the flyweight division has is they just don't have very much star power. But the talent is there, and if they groom it correctly, they can have some talent. So good win for Schnell, especially in a division that's wide open and maybe not even going to be here in a year. So we'll, we'll, we'll see.